Spy Mentality Edition 38. You ever, you ever get harassed by fanatics? I would call them fanatics, uh, religious Christians, or uh, you know some other religion, um, passing out flyers. You know, I can either approach this well. I'm not gonna get emotional or uh, angry about it. But you know, if, if one if one did, it would be rightfully so. Um, I was just watching a couple of uh, movies and doing some research before I talked about this. Um, uh, some commentary on atheists uh, with a, a caller that called in his uh, show that if you were to murder your uh, if God told you to murder your uh, kid, would you? And, and he said he knew it was wrong, but he would do it anyway. Problem with having just faith is you're blindly following it uh, because it's like uh, to me it's like a brand you know you're you're not taking initiative to think for yourself now I'm agnostic and logic tells you me that all this didn't just happen somebody something some entity or some higher power created this now that's just wisdom that's just uh, right and wrong logic to truth is to uh, it's something beyond what we can uh, comprehend or evaluate step by step uh, maybe based on logic we cannot evaluate it because it's beyond our comprehension I've been personally harassed uh, I don't like to use the word harassed but I've been mistreated uh, by individuals that think their morality is somehow superior to mine and because I don't follow a, a club. I call it a little fraternity uh, organization. And, and another word for it is cult. You know, a fanatic, a fan, and religion, it, it's kind of, uh, kind of relates. Because if you're a fanatic, you're crazy, you know, because they're so bent on their own superiority and there's only one uh, outcome. If you don't follow X, Y, and Z in the Bible, you're going to go to, uh, you're going to be damned and you're going to go to hell and you're going to do, you're, you're wrong and you're not as good as them. That's just flawed. That's flawed right there because if you think that way, and then, and then Christianity would... Uh, that that particular religion, they dismiss uh, every other religion, and you go search a list of all religions. Uh, there's a lot of religions: Hindu, Hinduism, Judaism. You know, you got you got uh, Jehovah's Witness, you got Catholics, you got Buddhism, which I don't care for. My family was Buddhist. You got you know, their claim to fame is that they're the only one and they're the best. Well, you can argue that if you believe in your own organization, of course you're going to make that claim that you're going to be the best. But the, the fact that they don't use logic, it seems like it, every Christian uh, that I've dealt with, they all walk the same, talk the same, think the same, ignorant the same. Now, there was another movie that says you can't, uh, you know, uh, there's always exceptions that there is a diverse opinions, like with every other group. Uh, but I'm not going to put a label on everybody. It's just wrong to, uh, especially if you're going to talk, you, you should know what you're talking about. And you make sure that you're correct. But they, they're flawed. It's like a flawed morality and that they try to impose uh, on others. I have a quote, religious types try to impose their misguided, flawed morality on others. 
you know, not I'll put the quote, but I don't remember on the top of my head. It's just uh, it's it's sad to see um, this type of behavior. You know, the behavior of smugness. You know, it's like a condescending you know uh, behavior in people with a lot of different things that we just don't have to be dealing with religious types so we can deal with just about it can apply to about everything that we do we're so sure of our uh, correctness that uh, we can't see anything outside the box of what what other people feel it, it, you know I'm not saying what I need to say here, but it's like <laughs> that it's it's just very disgusting and it, they're pushing their religion on other people and these uh e evangelist uh types that go out and uh you know try to convert people and don't recognize that that culture has their own religion and it's just as important as what you're trying to peddle but they act like they're superior and that's an ignorant attitude because hum humility you know is in short supply we gotta be humble and recognize we're not the the claim we're not the claim the fame we're the superior we're better than everybody else you know with Christianity they, they act like they're better than everybody else or something you know it's like it's that's that's a that just shows you're flawed right there. You're just proving it that you're flawed because of of your actions. And you know, it's like no matter what you say to a religious person, it just like even if it's right, they don't rec they don't acknowledge it. At least you know, with me, I acknowledge it. If I'm wrong, I'm wrong. If I'm right, I'm right. You know, you gotta acknowledge based on logic. There seems to be no logic in their re in their reasoning. I mean, you know, look at uh, the Scientology. Uh, the, 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 you gotta say all these little uh, uh, private things about yourself. Everybody you've had sex with, and this and that. I mean, and that's used against you, incriminating evidence, and all this. You know, it's like uh, it's it just. Religion has caused more deaths than it has done uh, good. I mean, can you can you really name anything? Uh, the misguided, uh, you know. Uh, oh, they give it to charities, or I'm watching these uh, prison uh, lock up or uh, locked up abroad or something, and, they, and these women come in and do uh, prisoner women's prisons hair, and then they start preaching. As I say, say, no cussing. Well, has it occurred to him no cussing is a form of censorship? You know, how how about you're trying to censor me? It's just as bad as what you're trying to say that I shouldn't cuss. That's what I'm saying. Is their misguided, ignorant views? Uh, you know, you can't get help but get get emotionally attached to it. You can't get emotional talking about is that get emotional because you've been, you know, people have been done wrong so wrong by religious types. Is in the name of, of preaching uh, righteousness or, or uh, right and wrong. It, it, right and wrong, they, they don't seem like they have any clue as to what right and wrong is. Right and wrong doesn't mean you impose yourself on other people and try to act superior. You know, that's a, then that makes you a hypocrite. I'm not. I'm not really getting what I want to say out in, in this in this one, but. Uh, for an intelligent person that can take initiative and see it outside the box, it's very clear.